Hello everyone! Welcome back to the channel. My name is Crafty Simmer and we are back with another episode of the Black Widow Challenge. Alrighty, I hope you are all having a great day. Um, anyways though, this is... Now the part where we're actually going to get ready to move in Victor. I said that we're going to go with Victor just because, I don't know, vampires, I don't really vibe with that much, so. But, you know, here we go. We're, I'm, but, you know, I'm carrying a vampire, probably. I don't know. It might be a vampire, it might be a mermaid. I don't know yet. <laughs> Anyways, though. So, I was kind of looking around here, and I noticed that Victor and Lily actually had a baby recently. So, I don't know. Like, I was planning to come over here and kill off Lily, and then... I saw there was a baby here, so I decided against that. Um, and because, you know, I still have some of like a heart somewhat, maybe? I don't know. Anyways, though, we're going to come up here. And we're going to... Um, we're going to brighten his day. And then for a little bit, we are going to have the... Uh, we, we're, like, we're probably going to take about... I'm going to get about 75% of the earnings of Victor and Lily and take all that money <laughs> or something like that. Like maybe we'll take like 60% 60, 60 maybe? I don't know yet. We'll have to figure that out when we get there. But anyways though, this is what we're doing today. <laughs> Especially since, you know, I really do want them to have like, I don't know, like yeah, so... Oh, okay. So, I don't know what just happened there, but she got a little excited for some reason. Anyways, uh, what else should we do here before we actually get him into our group here? I think we can actually get him. I think we can actually influence him to do something. Um, friendly. I know I can influence him to leave Lily. I still know where it is. Actions? No. Oh, your baby's hungry! And they're just gonna go off to Wood Hill. <laughs> they just, they are, I, I, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, I know there's a way for me to, like, influence him, to, like, break up with her. <gasps> oh, other sims, other sims, other sims. I just saw other sims. Other sims. Oh, I know there's, like, a way for me to get them to break up. I just don't know how to get it. Shoot. Anyways, though, I'm going to compliment him on his lean body. Because he is definitely not going anywhere with her. Ask a risque question. We're just going to flirt up with him because he is definitely a flirter, that's for sure. We're going to express that. And we are also, as well, going to talk about our ask about his sexual past. Even though, you know, we did literally see him, you know, have... Woohoo in our bed last episode. It's fine. Everything's fine. Um, we're going to attempt to seduce. So yeah, no. I'm okay if Victor, I'm, I'm okay if Boss gets taken away though. Because like, then I don't feel as bad for killing off Lily. We're going to... What else can we do with him? We're going to express love for that. And we're just... Oh, okay. So this is definitely what I'm trying to do here. Mermaid's kiss. Ooh. Okay, let's see what we... Let's see what that does with him. Uh-huh. 
That really wasn't anything too exciting, that's for sure. Alrighty, um, what else can we do with him? Like, I really just want him to, like, break up with her, but, like, I don't think I can get him to do that right now. I think I gotta get a little bit higher, just so that way I can get him to break up with her. Is it underneath mean, maybe? <sighs> We're gonna trash another sim. Ooh, yes, but he can't trash his wife. What else can I do? I just want him to go. I want to like get him to like break up with his wife, but I don't know how to do that. Mm. I am so tilted. But look at her though, she's just so happy. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Maybe we should just get Lily to go bye bye, maybe? Maybe we'll get Lily to go bye-bye. I think that is our goal right now, is to get Lily. Where is Lily? Where did Lily go? Is Lily not here? She's not. And the baby up there is crying. I'm just gonna let him cry. And then I won't feel as bad for, you know, Boston leaving. Boston getting removed from the family. And then I could just, you know, just kill him. <laughs> I can just kill Lily. And then everything would be good to go. Or maybe we'll also just do this as well. We're going to be friendly. We're going to get him to join the household. There we go. There. Okay. So they have about $59,000. How much do I want to take? I think we're going to take about like what like thirty five thousand? I think that's good I think that's a good number to take. Yeah, okay. And then we're gonna take him and leave. Oh, gee. oh you gotta go to work. Boy, go to work. Alrighty, there we go. We're all good to go now. I'm just going to boost up his energy a little bit, and then I'm going to go home. Because I got my mission done. <laughs> I got him, I got, I got Victor to move in with us, which is what I wanted to do this episode. Get him to like leave his, leave his wife and his child. <laughs> now that was to actually move into his house, but since, you know, they've got a baby. I don't want to complicate that, so we're just gonna let them be. <laughs> and then I think I actually make a spot for Victor as well. I just don't know where I'm gonna put him right now. Um, I mean, I think the goal is is that we're going to flirt it up with Victor tonight, get caught, and then that's gonna be like a whole situation. And then, what does his day look like tomorrow? And then he's off tomorrow. Does Victor work tomorrow? And then Victor works tomorrow. So then maybe we're going to send him off to preschool or something like that. And then we're going to make our move. I think that's the best choice. The best act, the best uh, action or something. Or maybe in like the middle of the night we'll just stab him in the back. There's so many choices I could go with. I just don't know how I'm gonna do it yet. Don't go swimming yet. We're 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 thinking, okay? We are thinking about how we're gonna handle this girl. Stop with the freaking swimming. Oh my god, you are fine. <laughs> I get that you're a mermaid, but let's just stop with this constant need to go to the ocean. Okay there girl? Okay. Alright, so anyways though, I think I'm just gonna have her... Oof, there's a lot that we can't do right now because we need them. We need both the... We need both Victor and, and, um, and H to be here. So I think what I'm gonna do is that we're just gonna cut until when 
um, Caleb and Victor get back, and then this is just going to be a little bit of a of a of a shitstorm, basically. I think that's where we're heading, is towards a shitstorm. So I'm just gonna add an extra chair to our table. And then what else do I want to do before we continue on? Before I do my cut. And I think for now, I'm just gonna give him like an air mattress. I think. I'm gonna give someone an air mattress. Someone is sleeping on this tonight. <laughs> I know that much. Don't know who yet, but someone's sleeping on it. Alright. There. That's our setup right now. So, probably Hage is going to be sleeping in here tonight. I'm going to, um, Victor and, and Ava are probably going to be sleeping in here tonight. Free pie. <gasps> Oh no! I lost supporters! How many supporters does he have? Oh my god. And he needs to like secure votes and stuff. Yikes. He gets paid like super well, so he's definitely gonna be making some money for me while I am, um, you know, moving on to like my next target and stuff. And then we're definitely going to have to get him divorced. But I kind of want to do it in like a way where... Yeah, okay. I'm gonna go cut though to where they come back from work. Because they both come back home at 4. And then this is all going to go downhill so beyond fast. So I'll see you all there. Alrighty, alrighty, so H and H and who else? And Victor are home now. Ava made herself some French toast because she was feeling a little hungry. And I'm actually going to get H to kind of clean up the mess that, um, <laughs> that Gail made because yikes, he made a huge mess everywhere. And I was going to change his like last name to ours too. Alright, I think what we're going to do though, is that we're actually going to get to do a little bit of potty training for Kale. And we're just going to just kind of carry on like life is normal, it's just, you know, there's a new guy in the house. <laughs> and then we're going to get Victor to flirt with her tonight at the dinner table. And that's going to cause some family drama. <laughs> and then that night, um, just before they go to bed and stuff, I'm going to have her basically murder him. Oh, wait! Oh my god! Why did I never think about this? One minute there, guys. I need to go get a mod. Ooh, I need to get a mod. Alright, so I am back now. I just, I had to get this mod. Okay, so this is a realistic death mod. So basically, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. I, I'm, I'm so ready to have fun with this. Um, so, I am, yeah, I'm really excited for this mod, so we're going to definitely play with this, this episode. Alright, anyways, though, she's gonna serve up a dinner, we're gonna make ourselves some, ooh, what she's gonna make? We're gonna make pasta primavera, because, you know, fancy, oh, right, she's potty trading, she's stuck, do I have to reset her? I'm about to reset her. I have to reset this girl, okay. Alright, so we're going to try to cook. Oh no, um, we're going to serve dinner. And we're going to serve a pasta primavera. And I might have teleported here so that we can get her to cook properly. There we go. And then the whole goal is to have her expose herself to, to, to H through flirting with Victor. Oh no, he's dehydrated! Oh, that sucks for poor Victor. What is he doing? He's just doing things right now. Alright, so she's going to make us some pasta. And this is what's going to happen. Okay, we're just going to get those mods off of him because he's definitely not having a good day with that at all. 
Kate is probably thinking, who the hell is this guy in our house? <laughs> Don't worry, it won't be long. Alright. Anyways though, it's time for us to call to meal. And this is how we're going to begin. With the exposure! But everyone needs to be sitting at the frickin' table! Why doesn't anyone sit at the table? I get so tilted by this because no one frickin' sits here and it's like, I have this here for a reason there guys, come on, take a seat at the table. Because this is how this is gonna work! I need the drama! There we go. Perfect. Perfect. H, go take a, go take a freaking seat. Y'all need to be, y'all need to be exposed. Like, come on. She needs to be exposed. And you're just vibing here. So, as for baby's due date, he's just gonna start up like a casual conversation with, um, with Eva. And I think what we're gonna do is go ahead here. Oh no. Okay, well, unfortunately, it isn't what I wanted. But that's okay. We'll adjust. Say no. I have no idea what she was even asking because, you know, that's a thing. Alright. So, anyways, though, I'm gonna actually have, have him come over here and be a romantic. And I'm going to have him embrace her, which should get H angry. Yeah, okay, perfect. He's jealous. Perfect. A flirty spouse. Oh no, whatever shall we do? Oh, I sure don't know. <laughs> so anyways, we're just gonna go capture this picture here. Please tell me I can at least get him to be... Okay, it looks like I can still kill him though, so that's good. Oof, I'm actually really nervous about this. Because like, there is actually a chance for them now to like... Um, to like, fight back. So this is kind of a scary thing. She might have to like, up her fitness skill here. So, um, okay. So we're just gonna do a little bit of a cheat. So, um, we're going to... What do we do here? Increase points? No. Cheat sim info. Skill cheats. Set skill. And then we're just going to give her like a level 5 in fitness. <laughs> because, like, she needs to be stronger than her victim. As That'll give, as that'll be a less, as that'll be like a, like a higher chance of him not doing it like that. So, anyways though, I am so excited. I am so excited just to cause this, just to cause, just to cause drama. Oh, he's going to tuck him in. And then I'm going to get Eva to come in here. And I'm going to get Victor. Victor actually needs to leave. I think we're going to send him somewhere just for a little bit while we're doing this. Explore services. He's going to go try for his license. And then we're going to bring in Kate, uh, H over here. And this is how we're going to start the drama. So, he's going to go ahead here. We're going to be mean. 
and we're gonna yell at her for being awful to us. Oh no, this is a bad. Oh no. Oh no, whatever shall we do? I don't know. Oh no. She is caught. She is caught. But what we're going to do here is that instead, we're going to basically... Ooh. Oh, I am so excited for this. I am so freaking excited for this. I just want to do it. We're just going to do it. He's just going to yell at us. And she's just going to be like, well, you know what? I'm done with you now. So, good night. So, I think that's what we're going to do. We're just going to be like, okay, well, good night. Bye. <gasps> now we'll despise each other. Oh, my. Look at this. <laughs> oh. oh my look at what happened and there are no witnesses Eva definitely does not believe in leaving some witnesses to come and view this horrendous act because it's not how she rolls And then he's just going to bleed out. It appears though someone is dying, you need to call services Im immediately and then select report a death. Well, we're not going to report a death quite yet because we need to take a shower first to get off all the blood. So we're just going to go ahead and take a shower. And then we're going to go ahead here and we're going to report. Oh, oh that was fast. Report a death. Oh my god. <laughs> I was not expecting that to happen so fast. That definitely freaked me out a little bit. Oof. Why? Okay, she needs to get the blood off her. How do I get the blood off her? <laughs> um... Options. More. How do I get her to clean herself up? Because she needs to get herself cleaned up because she's covered in blood. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what to do. She needs to clean herself up. Girl, do not do this. Oh no, she's calling. She's calling them. But she needs to, like, be cleaned. Oh no, um... MC dresser? Change outfit? Oh, she's still covered in blood no matter what I do. Ah! She needs to, like, take a shower, get this blood off of her. Take another shower, like, but, you know, we're just reporting a death first. Oh my gosh, she needs to, like, get herself cleaned. Like, seriously, like, this is, like, the first thing. You gotta, like, cover everything up. You just can't, like, go ahead and just do it. Alright, we need to go and change our appearance because, like... Yeah. Because, like, she... Because, like, she cannot be looking like this when, um... When Victor gets back. There. There. We covered her up. Oh my gosh. Girl! 
Can you, like, not do that to me, please? Thanks. Ugh. Okay, that just caused me a bunch of unnecessary stress. <laughs> Oh, she is still covered in blood. I don't know what to do to get her to, like, not be covered in blood anymore. And I'm kind of nervous. I don't know what to do. Like... Okay, how do I change? Let's plan outfits. Like, she needs to get this off of her. I don't know what's happening right now. I am just so beyond tilted that, like, I can't get this off of her. I can't get it off. This was like, okay, I don't even know how to get this off her right now because she's bloody. Oh my god. Eva, you need to kind of be a little bit more tidy with this. Oh my gosh. I am so tilted that she like got herself all dirty from doing that. Oh my god, Eva, why? Like, oh you just made this harder for us. Alright, anyways, though. I am so mad that happened. Oh my god. And she, like, I can't get the blood off of her. Like, what do I do? Calm self down. Let's try that. gonna face consequences uh -huh. Uh -huh. oh my god how do I do this I don't know how to do this <laughs> oh, <laughs> like I wonder if I just take this away would that take her no it doesn't shoot okay well this is gonna be fun I don't know what's happening we just have like a body bag just vibe in here Anyways, there, guys, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I'm going to investigate this, and I'll see you all in the next part. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Bye there, guys. <laughs>